is CBS News on the Hour. Real news, real reporting. I'm Jennifer Kuyper in Chicago. Those who support recalling Democratic California Governor Gavin Newsom say they have enough valid signatures to do it. CBS's Steve Futterman says the last attempt to recall a governor in that state was successful. This is certainly not unfamiliar territory for California voters 18 years ago in 2003. The then Governor Gray Davis was recalled and voters chose to replace him with actor Arnold Schwarzenegger. Already three Republicans, including transgender celebrity Caitlyn Jenner, have said they would run to replace Newsom. Southern California's only 24-hour local news and traffic station, KNX 1070 News Radio. Good evening, I'm Brian Ping. Our top local stories at 7.05. It's official. Governor Gavin Newsom will be up for a recall vote. Governor Newsom will face the chopping block after more than 1.6 million people sign on to a recall effort. California is getting another recall election 18 years after Arnold Schwarzenegger became a governor in a similar recall. It's likely to happen in the fall when voters will decide on the future of Governor Newsom. Under California law, voters will face two questions. First, should Newsom be recalled? And if so, who should take over? Among those who say they will run to replace Newsom, an Olympic decathlon gold medalist and reality TV personality Caitlyn Jenner and former San Diego mayor Kevin Faulkner. Notably, no Democrats other than Newsom have come forward to challenge the governor.